Uh, my name is Elin and I am uh, the communication lead and the project manager for Godavare Prabalia Vosh. I work at Vakin, which is a municipality owned organization in uh, Sweden, north of Sweden. Uh, and we, uh, our mission is uh, water, wastewater treatment and also uh, solid waste management in three municipalities. In working on this Godavari Prabalia Vosh project, how does Bhakin feel about the Godavari municipality team? Uh, we think they are uh, great people. They have lots uh, of knowledge. Uh, they're experts in their fields. Uh, and uh, over time, they also become very good friends to us. Uh, we have a great relationship, a mutual uh, peer-to-peer exchange. And, and uh, I think uh, this uh, relationship will last uh, way after uh, the project is finished. You have already been in Godavari municipality. What improvements did you see between this trip and the previous one? Uh, I've seen lots of improvements. Uh, the, the main thing we see if, is of course the construction work in Lele, uh, where they have done uh, a great work in protecting the water source. Uh, and uh, that project will now continue uh, in another phase. Uh, but we have also seen many other improvements uh, like trainings, for instance, in worker uh, safety and also uh, trainings in uh, water quality and water sampling. Over this visit, you got to know a lot of women, stakeholders and members of the community. How did you feel when you met with them? Uh, I've I felt very sad for uh, their situation. There are many hardships uh, for the workers, especially in the solid waste field. Uh, and also we listened to a lot of stories uh, of the importance of drinking water, safe drinking water close to your home. Uh, we were very moved by these stories and we will do our best in this project to help uh, improve their everyday life and everyday work situation. How do you intend to continue working with the Godavari municipality after this project is finished? Well, even though we uh, live in Sweden, which is very far from Nepal, obviously, modern technology has made it easy to keep contact. Uh, we're only an email or a Teams meeting away. So I'm sure that this, uh, after this project is finished, we will continue working together uh, and help each other improve both of our societies. Does the backend team have any difficulties in supporting to the Godavari municipality? No, I don't think we have. I think it's very easy to work with uh, the, the Godavari team and the Godavari municipality. We have a very uh, friendly collaboration. Uh, we have, we're. Uh, helping each other and we are inspired by each other. So also the Vakin team uh, will go back to Sweden with uh, new knowledge and also uh, inspiration to continue our work for a sustainable society. And waste three recommendations are the most important for the Godavari municipality to implement waste related activities. Uh, yeah, one thing we have talked about in the Vakin team is that it is important. You could be tempted by uh, advanced technology but it is important to have uh, systems that are easily maintained uh, and sustainable over a long period of time with accessible uh, spare parts, for instance, uh, and also facilities that is easily operated. So that's one thing we, we think to keep things simple, as simple as possible. Um, also, uh, to always have the worker and the end user close to heart because it's for them we do these improvements. Um, and I also think that testing in small scale is a, a thing uh, that you don't implement like a big change. Uh, instead, you test it. For instance, if you are working on solid waste management, you could do testing in a small community and see if something could be upscaled in a later stage. So that's my three recommendations.